Before the video starts, I would like to ask that you guys subscribe to my channel, turn on the bell for notifications, leave a comment down below, and like the video. I would heavily appreciate it. Hope you enjoy. Hey guys, do you want to waste money on stuff you really don't need? How about stickers on my new Teespring store? You, can gather, you guys can get either a very cute cat, a very lovely hat, or an incredibly angsty boy. Yay. Yeah. If you guys want to buy any of these products, be sure to visit the link down below in the description. I often wonder what my purpose is. I go from town to town and live out my mundane life. Eat a little here, steal a little there. Not like I can't have a good life. I just choose not to. I was someone else back then. Someone I'm not proud of. Now, here I am. I wish I could take it back. Take back all the things I did. Take back all the wrongs I committed. Take back the lives I took. Take back the people I hurt. But there's no point in dwelling on the past. The future is what will live on. And I must move with it. Someday, I'll pay back what I've done. But until then, here's hoping I'll make it to that day. I'm sorry, Master. I wish I controlled myself better. I hope you'll be proud of me one day. If you have that all in mind, I want you to try to jump across the pond. It's not that big of a jump, but if you know where to jump... Keep your eyes closed, by the way. If you know where to jump, it should be rather easy, okay? Dang, dang it. Uh, okay, you good? You good? Alright, come on. Let's try it again. Try it again. I think you're imagining it, but you're not using any magic. Hmm, to be fair, imagining doesn't really help. Actually, no, imagining doesn't make the magic happen. It just helps it, though, makes it easier. Here. Come on. Wait, turn around, turn around. Your eyes closed? Alright. Now I'm gonna cast some on you, alright? And you'll basically be able to see it with your eyes closed, right? Do you see it? All right, I want you to jump now, again, all right? Whenever you're ready. There you go, kid. With that, that was just jumping. I helped you with that. You still need to learn how to do it yourself. <laughs> all right, I see you're happy. Still, you gotta learn how to do it yourself, okay? Alright. <sighs> I think that's enough training for today, by the way. Unless you wanna keep trying it yourself. You wanna? Alright, alright, alright. I'm not gonna stop you. But, you come inside if it gets too cold, alright? Okay. <sighs> okay. Jesus, what the hell's happening here? Hi. Hey. What? What? Oh, yeah, wanting this, yeah, uh-huh. Uh, well, yeah. I heard the hammering, I thought they were just, like, 
fixing the. They replaced the I floor. Changed literally everything. Yeah. Huh. I made it more fun and cozy. I I see that. I see that. Mm -hmm. And I, I changed the kitchen too a little bit. Changed the layout. Gina I'm still Tavis. fiddling with it. How do they build this magic? What am I talking it's the about? same thing. I just kind of moved this over. This I, thing I know, and I know. It's just... And then, um... I changed the, the, the tablecloth and the, the fabric for the couch, but I have it all folded up in this drawer because I know it's a lot of memories, so I thought maybe she wanted to take a pillow out of it because that'd be cute, you know? <laughs> yeah. You know, she could. I know. And then um, this is where the toolbox goes. I had a cuter, like, flowers here. And then I put the uh, photo scrapbooks up there. Yeah. I don't know what they're called. I forgot the word, where's, literally. Uh, where's Damien's bed? Over here. Really changed this place up. And then this is, I, I got her, I got her uh, this painting here. It's like, it's got flowers. Because I, I, she told me that Harold used to give her a bouquet of flowers, flowers every, every day, day after work. Yeah, he did. Mm -hmm. So I thought it'd be cute if I got, like, you know, over their bed. <laughs> and then this is Damien's wardrobe. You know, when they start getting clothes, I can just start putting stuff here. Yeah, yeah. I was going to put, like, a bedside table here, but I, I, that'd be too close. And I don't want Betty to hurt herself. Yeah. You know? Um, I would put a toy chest, but, you know, that's pretty big, and, um, what about these found paintings? her sewing stuff. Oh, don't, yeah, they're just, you know, they were kind of hard to find, but, you know, I got them. What? You know. What? Hard to find? You know, the theming, you know, I'm just kind of going with the theming. How much money did you spend, Kat? Because you, uh, you painted uh, over the walls, obviously, and then... And I you added, added trimming. trims. And then I changed the ceiling. Did you, changed... you see the ceiling? How much was this? It was fine. Hey, kid. Hi. Uh, <laughs> place is a lot different, huh? Yeah, it's pretty different now. Um, you don't have your own room because I don't really have. You know, I didn't really think about like expanding a room or anything. We don't Especially because like for expansion, you gotta talk. To exactly, we don't room. have. Yeah, exactly, I'm not doing that. So, uh, unfortunately, instead of like sleeping over here, the you know, um, you have a bed right here. Go on. Come on. You get to share a space with Betty. Yeah. And then this is where your clothes will go when you fit when you eventually get more clothes. I don't know why you don't have that many clothes, to be quite honest, but you know. He has your toys. Uh, been a, yeah. I mean, okay. What I'll help you with that out. <clears throat> yeah, I know. I'll help out with that, man. Maybe should no. should I, should I, should I... Hey, 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 kid. Shh. Um, keep playing with your toys. I'm gonna yeah. talk to Cat. I, mean, I, I put bit. some. I put your crayons and some paper and coloring pages I'm in one of these drawers. So you can just look at. Oh, come on. Okay, I'm coming with you. money did you spend you don't have to worry about that i i think i have to sorta a little bit why i mean look at this place it must have cost a fortune do you think this really costs a fortune i mean you, you, you build up the roof you tore out the floors you change the ceiling you you move the you move the layout of the I kitchen i mean the floor slightly. is pretty much the exact same i just had it more like like varnish correctly like better like it Either was wearing way, the down. The ceiling is completely replaced. Yeah, I thought it was safer and to have something more stable. These themselves, they look like, like like someone. They look they look rich. Is that like an insult or a compliment? No, it's just <sighs> expensive. Yeah, it looks expensive. Well, Betty did tell me that she used to live in a small villa. She did. So, yeah. Before uh, she lived here with Harold and when they retired, she lived in like a smaller village, not in the town, like here in the city, Lantine. So, I thought it'd be cool to like get some stuff that reminded her of, you know, being there. So, I didn't really care how much it costs. And besides, I, had, I know a lot of people who sell paintings because I love paintings. So, right. I just, you know. I made a few 
connections and I pulled some strings. <sighs> She's gonna cry when she sees this. I hope not. That'd make Cheers me sad. Joy. I know, but seeing seeing people cry is just not my thing. <laughs> yeah. It's sad. But I mean everything else is pretty much the same. I left the coffee table and I left the rug and the welcome yeah. mat and you know everything that I could because I just didn't want her to feel like she was living with a ghost anymore oh you know we loved each other for a very long time I don't no you're right she, she needs to move on she told me that she's wants to move on but she doesn't want to move on in the sense of like meeting someone new she just wants to feel like she's not living in a museum of their old memories yeah yeah so i thought maybe putting a coat of paint over you know everything yeah (laughs) and um i also found something when i was moving the the cabinets and stuff yeah. What was it like? Some sort of mold, or no? I, if there was, I'd take care of it. But um, it was kind of stuck somewhere. A letter. I don't think she knew about it. So oh. I want to give it to her. Can I see it? Yeah. Yeah. He always hid these letters, you know. Yeah, she told me he'd hide them all around the house, so... That's why I was moving stuff around, trying to see if there was anything hidden. I guess there was one left. (laughs) But I I I don't think she could have seen that with how far it was tucked (laughs) under stuff. (laughs) Yeah. So... Probably not. I'm glad I could give that to her, though, or if you can, that'd be fine. Done a lot already. Happy to help. <sighs> and I even fixed her oven because I know she said that it's been acting really stupid lately. Yeah, so sometimes I have to kick it a bit. Start. Mm-hmm. So I got somebody to fix it, and it's all good. She can bake pies and cakes, and cookies, and record timing now (laughs) really yeah I mean I don't know why I wouldn't I mean just like he just came in and like changed my my grandma's life practically yeah but you know it (laughs) It was nothing. You don't have to say anything like that. <laughs> I don't see why not. We've been dating for about a month now, I'd think. Yeah. Guess we have. <laughs> <laughs> uh, listen, I, I... I gotta go get Betty. She, I think she's done at the hospital now. I'm not sure, though. Okay. Um, I should probably g- get going too. <laughs> you sure? I'm pretty sure Betty would love to like have you here. She might make oh, you a pie after all. It's fine. She can make me a pie in there. Time. Uh, besides, I've been doing this pretty much all day, so I should uh probably get back to my house and see how everything's going. If you're sure. Just, just let her know um it was no big deal and she doesn't have to pay me back. Okay. Can I pay you a visit later, then? Yeah, sure. If you want. Yeah. Um... You mean to walk you out, or...? Uh, sure, sure. Uh, I also put some shutters outside the house, too. <laughs> Probably better so if than it's like... boards. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. If anything bad would happen, she could just close those up. <laughs> yeah. You want me to walk you home, or do you want to... Oh, it's, it's alright. You should go get to Betty now. <laughs> 
Yeah. I'll, I'll talk to you later, okay? I'll talk to you later, too. You sure you're okay? Mm-hmm, yeah. I'll see you later, Davis. See you later, Cat. A strange woman. <laughs> <clears throat> hey, Damien. So look, I'm gonna be bringing Betty back soon, all right? That means pretty much now, by the way. <laughs> so, do me a favor. Sit tight, just play with your little toys, all right? All right, kid. Stay there. Betty's gonna lose her shit when she sees this. <laughs> Lantite Hospital. There you are. Oh, God. Lantite Hospital. Nice to be here. <sighs> Betty. Um, ah. Hello. Welcome hey. Welcome to Lanside Hospital. How can I help you? I need to, uh, I, I, I'm, I'm visiting, um, a family member. Um, okay. Uh, does she, what is her name? Or oh. is her name is Davis. Her name's Betty. Okay. Uh, oh. Right, Betty. Betty uh, she should be in the room to the left. Uh, what? My left. Oh, okay, sorry. <laughs> it's alright. <okay. laughs> Betty. Oh, hi, dearie. Hey. How are you doing, dear? I I'm, do I'm doing good. What about what about you? No. Uh, oh, pain? I'm doing just fine. No pain. <sighs> So I'm all well. <laughs> yeah, thank God for healers, am I right? So I'm free to go. They told me I'm free to go, but I waited for you because I, I'm old <laughs> and I don't like walking by myself no more. I know, I know. It wasn't. They it didn't hurt when they healed you and all that, did they? Did it? No, nah, it was fine. I can deal with it. Okay. But thank you for worrying, though, dear. Arms fine. Yep, all good, all fine. <laughs> okay. We should probably go then, huh? Yeah, we should get on out of here. All right. How's everything at home? Is Damien doing all right? He's doing better. Um, That's good to hear. Yeah, let's just go. I'll show you. It's a bit of a surprise. Oh, surprises. We all know I like surprises. <laughs> I know. I know. Should probably go ahead and get the bill. This probably wasn't free. Fuck. Yeah, this wasn't free. Hey. No, so, uh. No, sir. All right, I have Betty. Is there a bill we have to pay? Oh, uh, yes, there is. Uh, here you go for Betty. <laughs> okay, um. Th 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 mm, th 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 thank you. Thank you. Um. <laughs> um we'll come back. Yeah, right? I, everything's okay. fine. Don't worry about it. <laughs> We'll be back later to pay for it, all exactly, right? Exactly, exactly. Thank you. Bye, buddy. Take care. Thank you. Bye, dear. How much does it cost? 4,000 gems. What? You have to speak up a little bit, dear. 4,000 gems. 4,000 gems? It's technically a private hospital. Ah, uh, well, I, um, I have stuff and savings, but I don't want to spend all that. I know. Maybe I can send a letter to my other kids, see if they can pay some <laughs> bit of it. Maybe. I... I hope. They can probably pay a little bit, not the whole thing. What are you on about? What? Uh, hmm. So this is due about the end of the year. I... I can get the money. Well, don't work yourself to death over it, dear. No, 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 I... I can. I'm still gonna contact my other kids to make sure. <laughs> All right. Uh, okay, buddy. You take so much care of me. I want to make sure it's distributed equally. <laughs> All right. Um, I'm not sure if you want to walk back or. I think you want to blink us back, don't you? I mean, it's faster. Let's be honest. All right. Is it gonna be dizzying again for me? It will be. It's something you gotta get used to. I'm old. I don't have to get used to nothing. You're gonna be a stubborn woman, aren't you? 
Well, Harold was. I could be too. <laughs> ah, goodness gracious! You uh, just get so dizzy and over it. It's all right. I'm all so right. I'm all right. all right. It's all right. I mean, it's. What is that on my window? Those are uh, shutters. Oh, the roof is repaired, by the way. Oh, the roof is repaired. I can't see it very well, but I think it's repaired. It's uh. The trimming's at least repaired. It's it's all good up here. Oh, good, good, good. Thanks for checking, dear. Yeah. Man, to be young and agile again. <laughs> right. So um, what's this surprise we're telling about besides the shutters? So, Cat stopped by after the uh, all this, this stuff happened. And she repaired the roof. And she told me not to worry about it. And she also got, and, well, she, I think it's just better if you see it. See what? The door is deep. I think she had some people put the trim in, but I think she painted the walls herself. I am not too sure. Betty? Yeah. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm just so happy right now. <laughs> okay. It's, it's so beautiful. I wish... I wish Harold did something like this. <laughs> he was always a real basic man. Oh, speaking of which, I still brought this with me. Of course. I didn't really think you'd let go. The couch is different. It's still the same. She said she put the fabric in one of the dresser things. Oh, that's very sweet of her. Oh, it's so beautiful. I, I love it. It's so beautiful. And the carpet's still here. Oh, it's so wonderful. The carpet's older than me. It is. It is older than you. And the paintings are so pretty, and all oh, the kitchen, I have so much more room to move around in, and not get blocked in. It's like so open here. She, she, she also did your room. Oh. <gasps> she and, did? Yeah. By the way, Damien's in there right now, so. <gasps> oh, they, oh, wow. <laughs> hi, hi, dear. Hi, dear. Wow. I, I did mention I like this color. <laughs> you did. You got your bed in here and your toys. That's good. That's good. Yeah. Oh, I love this so very much. <laughs> she also... I got my one last surprise, I guess. Um, yeah? Obviously, she moved some of the kitchen stuff around and all that, but uh, she um, found this. It was probably in between one of the cupboards. Okay, 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 okay. Let's just go back inside. She's gonna read that, alright? So go back inside. <laughs> you know what Harold used to do? All the time, he would write little notes, either on sticky papers or full on letters, and hide them around the house. I would find them every now and then and give it to Betty. And, uh. I think it might be one of the last ones. So just. Let her have her space, all right? Okay. You want to continue training magic? All right. Hey, Betty, we're going to be outside training, all right? Mm -hmm. Okay, come on. Come, come on. Let's go. There you go. Okay. Close it. All right. She'll come out here and get us, don't worry, okay? 